One, two, three. It's an incredible victory to be able to come out here and defend our home course. I mean, that's it's always tough to come out and, and host an event and all the things that go on with hosting an event. And But to come out here and to, to see the team stick to a game plan and really execute and, and have conviction all week with what they were doing. We we knew what we wanted and we were going out there and we made it work. You know, we, the greens are great out here. So all we need to do is get it on the dance floor and we can go from there. It feels good. I mean, I I saw how much we won by whenever I got off 18 and that was that was a pretty cool feeling just to dominate our home course like, like we did. And there are a handful of good teams here. So it was good to get the team W and then obviously winning individually is just a bonus. I think we're playing well. I mean, I know Noah's had a really good run. I'm starting to play better. George is playing better. I mean, I think we're all just clicking. I mean, we're all sticking to a game plan before we tee off and then throughout the round. And I just think we're in a good place team-wise right now. We had great team chemistry. The guys, you know, they hung out. They, they knew what they wanted and just the way they fought for each other. That's the biggest thing is when you have a team, you, you're going to have talent and you're going to have talented teams. But when you jive as a team and you really understand how to fight for each other and to limit your mistakes, that's what matters. And these guys did it great. I mean, there's, you know, having two guys tied for the lead with the last three holes, I mean, that's a coach's dream. You're hoping somebody wins it versus losing it because you know it's a tough loss for the guy finishing in second. But you know, the guys battled. They did a great job. And, you know, it's just an honor to be able to coach them and, and what they did this week. It feels good. It feels good. Um, I mean, I felt like I controlled my nerves pretty well coming down the stretch. Just hit one bad tee shot coming down 16. But I made a really good par save. And I felt like I kept my head throughout the whole round and just stayed patient because I know there were some birdie holes after I got off to a rough start. So just staying patient, like Coach said, that was that was the key for me all week. I mean, we have a month left, and we take all the positives. It's long-term memory on the good stuff and short-term memory on the bad stuff. And if these guys do that and, and see what that brings, it, we're, we're going to be dangerous come conference time. And these guys are just starting to peak. We haven't fully done it, but we're starting to peak. And it's a real good feeling to shoot under par out here at Chenault. I mean, we haven't come close to that in my four years, and these guys are doing a great job.